Hello, boys and girls. Hello, families. And of course, hello, all students. Welcome, welcome, welcome to an adventure. An adventure. We're so happy you're with us today. Our story is going to be about, well, we know it's magic story time. We don't forget that. It's a lot about magic today. The title of our story is Five More Sleeps Till Christmas. Five more sleeps till Christmas. And our main character's name today is a little boy. You can see him in the book. That's Gary. This is a picture of Gary. Gary is wearing, he wears glasses and he uses them all the time. He's dressed in his pajamas for the holidays. So you'll see Gary a lot in the story. Hi, boys and girls. Hi, boys and girls. I'm Gary. I'm the main character. The story is going to talk about me. Now, Gary has a little pet, a little stuffed dog. that he That's where he goes everywhere with and sleeps with. If you have a little stuffed animal that you sleep with, maybe you want to run along. Run along, run along, and go get it so you can be comfy during a story because the setting is his bedroom, where he sleeps, where he sleeps. All right, let's begin. Oh, yes, the author is Jimmy Fallon, and it's from the number one New York Times bestselling author, Jimmy Fallon. So, you know, sometimes I show you about some information inside the book. Well, this one has something that we think about before I read. It says, we're all were born with a sense of wonder and excitement and joy and joy. Believe in magic. We all believe in magic. It just makes us feel good. It just makes us feel good. All right. I want to start out because this story tells you five days before Christmas and our character Gary is so excited that he cannot sleep. He keeps thinking about the countdown. Five, four, three, two, one, until Christmas appears. So the story starts out with Gary pacing, walking around in different directions, in different speeds. He walked around so much you can tell that his socks are starting to come off and get loose and get loose. So he's pacing and pacing Five more sleeps till Christmas. So let's get started. Five, look at the number. Isn't that colorful? I love this colorful book. Five, just five more sleeps till Christmas. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? It's gonna be here? Can you believe it? I know that Santa's coming soon cause I've been good all year. I've been good all year. I've been good all year. That's what Gary says. Now, these are the ways that Gary has been good all year. I want you to think about the ways you've been good all year. All right, let's see if some of them match Gary's, or you might have some different ones. That's why we're magical. Gary said, five more sleeps till Christmas. I'm not sure. I'm not sure that I can wait. He said, I got good grades. Raise your hand if you got good grades in school. Oh, I see lots of hands. And I have my little sign. If you got an A plus, maybe a lot of you got an A plus or a smiley face, you know, or a hundred, 
percent, that would be great. He said that. He said, I got an A plus. I fed my dog. Look at him. Look at all that dog food he put in the bowl. Plenty. He did feed me. He did feed me. It was good. Thank you, Gary. Thank you, Gary. It was good. I even cleared my plate. You see his plate? And of course, his little puppy's trying to get to some of his food. He cleared his plate. His plate looked like this. Let me see if I can get it. There was nothing left in his plate. He cleared his plate. And if you do that, you can always show your families, I cleared my plate. They would love all those responsibilities that you did. Now, look at this. He is in his bedroom. This is where the setting is, where the story takes place. He's in his cozy, cozy bed with his little stuffed animal, his puppy with a candy cane, a candy cane, a colorful candy cane that was laying right next, next to his blanket. He reminded him of Christmas and goodies. His eyes are open. He's still wearing his glasses. And let's see what he says. Gary Chew, Gary's Chew Toy Puppy, that's him, that's me, is helping him count the sheep. Look at the sheep. One, two, three, four, five, and so on. But it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. We cannot fall asleep. We cannot fall asleep. They could not fall asleep. Maybe that's happened to you before. Now, after they kept counting and counting the sheep, one, two, three, four, five, all of a sudden you can see, they fell asleep, both of them. They're asleep in their bed. And Gary fell asleep with his glasses on. Zzz, zzz, zzz. His glasses fell a little sideways. Then we said the number five. If we're counting down, what are we going to count? What's going to come under number five? Oh, I heard it, Miss Mansky. Number four. All right, you're so good. You could even make a number four in the air if you want. Number four, counting down. Just four more sleeps. Four more sleeps till Christmas. And a visit from Kris Kringle. The halls are decked, the trees trimmed. The bells are being jingled. Okay. The bells are being jingled. The tree is being trimmed. I'll show you the tree later again. The tree is being trimmed. Let's see what happens next. And those bells keep ringing. And look at Gary, his puppy and his sister. They didn't tell me the name of his sister in the story. You can give her a name that you like. You can use your magic and give her, you know, a name that you like. Now, after they finished with the tree, they got a little tired. Look at their big, big couch. Maybe some of you are sitting on a big couch right now, being cozy, listening to the story. The little dog tries to climb up there too. And it says, the candy canes are crunched. Look at the candy canes. Remember the candy canes? They crunch them, they crunch them, they crunch on candy canes. Do you crunch on candy canes? Be careful. And it says the cocoa hot inside their mugs. They were drinking some hot, hot cocoa. And I'm, I'm gonna see if I have my hot cocoa here. Oh, yes I do. It's kind of behind me. I didn't wanna burn myself. So I put it in a safe spot. So this is my hot, hot cocoa. The hot, hot cocoa that they smelled. And it had a little candy, candy cane on top. 
the hot, hot cocoa. Maybe you have some hot cocoa this holiday. And candy canes. The popcorn. It, this is empty, they said. They ate so much popcorn. Look at their popcorn bucket. They didn't have any more in it. They were thirsty. They were hungry. Because they munched and munched on the popcorn. Just four more sleeps. Just four more. And then it's here. I have to go to bed. I have to go to bed. As he's thinking about all these things, he said, but visions, thoughts, and visions, all his favorite toys, everything that he wanted was dancing in his head. Look at all of them, a soccer ball. Presents, bicycles, Legos, all these thoughts were dancing in his head. Let's see what was dancing in his head. Let's see if Mr. Minsky brought some of the things. I asked Gary, and he kind of told me of some of the other things. Okay, here we go. Do you want to see him? All right, here we go. Oh, Gary, he wanted a big truck. Oh, yeah. I want a big truck. I love big trucks and bulldozers. Did he want? Oh, I wanted. Oh my goodness. He wanted a big, big dinosaur. Of course, T-Rex, the meanest and the toughest and the tallest and the strongest. He wanted that. He also wanted. Oh my. Lots of teddy bears, lots of teddy bears, lots of teddy bears, different sizes. He wanted lots of things, but he still held on to his favorite, his little puppy, his little puppy. All right, so now Gary has fallen asleep as he's thinking about all those things that he wants, but he's falling asleep almost upside down. His head is hanging, hanging down from his bed, glasses still on, his list to Santa is on his bed. He keeps writing and writing more things that he wants. I bet you have a list. I bet you have a list of things that you want and you make a list for Santa. All right, oh, here's some more things he wanted. Do you want me to read a little bit more? A little bit, it says a bike, a guitar. Oh, and he loves to look out in space. He wanted a spaceship too. And a basketball. Oh, he wants a lot. He wants a lot. Okay. So we went five, four. If we're counting down, what are we counting down to? Oh, that you shouted that one. Three, Mrs. Szymanski. One, two, three. Oh, we're getting closer to Christmas. Okay. Three. Here's the big three. Look how good they're decorated. And maybe you want to write numbers down and decorate them like holiday themes. That would be cool. You could do a five, then a four, a three, a two, and a one. It says, now it's three more sleep days till Christmas. I'm looking at that snow. Look at him. He went out to his window with his sister and his puppy, and they're looking and looking out the window to see the snow coming. And I have a little globe here to kind of show you what the snow might be looking like if it comes down, if it comes down from the sky. We don't see a lot of snow in Florida, but we can buy toys and things that show us how snow works. And that's the scene they saw outside. That's what they saw outside. That was beautiful. Now, Gary said, I'm in my cozy bed. I'm in my cozy bed. That's me with lots of Christmas thoughts to think of. There he is in his cozy bed, his blanket over his head. He made himself cozy. You can do that sometimes. You can put a little blanket over you, make yourself cozy. And he even took his little puppy and they're writing more things 
for the Christmas list to Santa. And just, now we said three, what's gonna come after three? As we're going counting down. Oh, boy, I think this side, that side, this side, this side, that side. I heard two, Ms. Amansky, just two sleeps left, two. When I wake up, but I can't sleep a wink. I can't sleep a wink. I cannot sleep a wink. And let's see what happened if he slept. Even though he said that, boys and girls, you see the Z's. He's asleep laying on his tummy and he's still wearing the glasses. The puppy's still close to him and he has, he's listening to some music that probably helped him go to sleep. That probably helped him go to sleep. Let's see what kind of music he could have heard. Something kind of calming a little bit. Let me hear it. Oh, he heard a little music that helped him go to sleep. Okay, we said two. Look at that decorative number two. You could even do that as an art project. Number two. Wow. But look how he's still pacing. Two days were still too long for Gary. They're too long for me. Even two days are too long. Still too long. And it's two more sleeps till Christmas. Why can't this day be done? Gary asks, why can't this day be done? Oh boy, he's really, he can't wait now. If I can get just one more sleep, then it will be down to, what do y'all think? Let's predict. It will be down to what? Oh, somebody had a finger up there going to one, Ms. Amansky, to one. Okay, here's Gary. He has one more day to go. He's still walking around. His socks are flipping up and down. He has Christmas lights in his room. His pillow, look at his pillow. It's just unfluffed. It's everywhere. The puppy's looking at him. You know what he's thinking. I can't wait. I can't wait. So now he falls asleep again. He falls asleep. Look at the Z's. With his glasses on. His puppy, wait, let me see where his puppy is, right down here. His puppy's holding a candy cane. I think he got hungry. <laughs> I think he got hungry. But look, he has this list with him, the Santa, and he's adding more and more and more. Do you do that sometimes? Do you wake up different days and you add up more and more and more items to your Christmas list? Please, list. He does. He does. Okay, one. Wow, that's beautiful. Look how they did the number one. Because it's Christmas day, they have Christmas lights. And a star at the top. And a star at the top. One more sleep till Christmas. Is this day finally here? I put out Santa's, let's see what he said. Is this day finally here? I put out Santa's cookies and the milk on it for his reindeer. Oh, let's see. Let me take a look and see if Gary did that. He said he did that, but I want to double check. Okay, he did. There's the delicious cookies that Gary put out there. They're chocolate chip round cookies. He put them out there. Oh, he almost made a face. He put them out there for Santa and let me see. He said he put milk. So let, let me check to see if he put that. I'm looking at the table to see if he did that. Oh, in a special little cup, he put out the milk for the reindeers. <gasps> Gary, you did all that. 
Way to go, Gary. I did all that. I said I did. I did all that. that young, I might have a cookie after. I don't know. I like those cookies. Okay, Gary. No, that's for Santa, okay? You can have some later in your own place. Okay. <laughs> we had to tell Gary so he doesn't eat all the cookies before Santa comes. Oh, yeah. So I want to show you a picture. He said what he did. See, all the cookies and his, and that's his sister right up there and his little, and the milk, that's up there too. But look at Gary, he's still adding and adding to his list. Oh my good, goodness, Gary. Now I'm snuggled in pajamas. See, all of us are kind of snuggled in our little pajamas and the stockings have been hung, the stockings. Let me get that. The stockings, he had one for his sister. His sister loved Frozen. And he wanted to make sure that I showed that to you. Anna and Elsa. Anna and Elsa. With little snowflakes all over towards the bottom. He was nice and was asking things for his sister too. That's wonderful. The tree has been unplugged. Okay, let me get my tree. Give me a minute. I told you you're gonna see my tree again, didn't I? All right. Give me a second here. There's a lot of visuals. So the tree that was in his house, you see it? It was all decorated in Gary's house with beautiful lights and ornaments in Gary's house. But at the very end, this is what the story says. The trees have been unplugged. So we have to unplug them. The trees were unplugged. Let's see what happened. And all the carols, remember, we did our little bells, all the carols made their beautiful, and I even have it on my, on my sweater. And all the carols, all the carols were sung. Okay, let me hear a few carols before we, we take them all. You see how the carols, they were finished. The tree was, was not lit anymore. Just one sleep left till Christmas. The day is coming really soon. And can it be, can it be, can it be, can it be? I think I saw a sleigh go past the moon. He was looking at his telescope here. Do you see this picture? He loved looking out in space with his telescope. And this is what he, I think he saw. Let me turn the page. He saw, look at this. He saw the reindeer and Santa coming, coming, coming across in the sky. And he fell asleep because that's what you do the night before Christmas. You fall asleep. His puppy's asleep and he's asleep. Oh, but one time his puppy woke up and saw it all too. Oh, puppy. I'm a smart one. <laughs> Let's see what happened the next day. Use your imagination. He was asleep at night. The reindeer and Santa Claus were coming outside at night. What do you think is gonna happen next? Oh my, oh my, look at Gary and his sister. They're sliding down the, the, the chair rails there. Something that's not very safe, but they're sliding down. They're so happy. 
They're jumping with joy. Today is finally Christmas. Today is finally Christmas. I run down the tree. I ran down to the tree. I ran, 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 ran down to the tree. I can't believe. I can't believe it. Santa came. I can't believe it. Santa came and brought these gifts all for me. And of course, for his sister. Brought lots of gifts for me. Merry, Merry Christmas. It's really, truly here. He said, Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas. It's truly, truly here. And look what he did. He opened up one of the presents. He played some music ding, 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 with his guitar. His sister got a teddy bear. Oh, 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 oh. They got matching teddy bears. I love my bear, I love my bears, the sister said. And Gary said, I got one too. I love my bear, love my bear too. There she is loving her bear, loving her bear. And they got so many presents. And now I start, oh my goodness, it's holding its puppy. I start the countdown again. Oh my, come on, Gary, come on, Gary. He said, only 364 more sleeps. Till next year, till next year. Look how tired he was. He laid down, down, down. And he fell asleep. The end, the end.